And now, Friday Night Fever with Mike Ludlam. Good evening, everyone. The Houghton Gremlins are ranked fourth in this week's UP High School Girls Basketball Big Five poll. The Gremlins travel to Iron County tonight to meet West Iron County. And the White Cons were ready to go, but it wouldn't take long for the Gremlins to get going either. The steal by Tana Ryan and them. And she will go coast to coast for the layup and a 2 0 lead for the Orange and Black. Emmy Keener finding Lizzie Pleaser. And now the Gremlins still have the lead at 4 3. To the second quarter, Keener for three. Yes. White Cons grab an 8 6 advantage. Gremlins fight back. Ryan in in the corner for three more. It's 9 8 Houghton. And the Gremlins would go on to win 52-32. Zone Sloan Center had 15 points for Houghton. Hop in the car. Let's go to Forest Park, where the number three team, the Little Five Pole, entertained North Central. Second half action, Maria Stankowitz. Nice no-look pass underneath to Abby Nyland for two of her 14. And the Trojans are up two dozen. And Forest Park getting some good passing. Stankowitz, Becky Kalenda, and that's good for two more. 40 to 10, Trojans. North Central shots, uh, they just weren't falling tonight. In fact, some of them were just outright getting stuck on the rim and backboard. That's how some nights go in life. And the Trojans would get the victory 61 to 32. Hope Plunger with that hoop. Meanwhile, Nagani at Westwood, Kirk Corcoran and the Westwood Patriots having a little trouble getting the offense going. That's Haley Fazat taking the deflected pass for the hoop and the harm. 13-2 minors after a little more than five minutes. Courtney Finella, Abby Nelson, yes, 16-2, maize and blue. And Westwood gets a basket here. Lauren Farley to Marissa Corello. Nice move to the basket. Stops, takes her time, puts it up and in, but the Patriots trailed 18-4 after one. Brandon Sager continues to coach with the lead. And Clara Johnson, Abby Nelson after a few screens for the layup. And Nagani went on to win this one, 62-27. Heather Salmi scores here for Westwood. Courtney Finnella scored all 15 of her points in the second half. On the scoreboard, Bark River Harris, number one team, the Little Five Four, stretches its, its lead and defeats Iron Mountain 82 46. Harley Castor at 20 for Norway, 978 North Dickinson 25. Ishpeming a road win at Manistee 43 29. Kingsford 10 better than Monomany 44 34. Barriga holds off Jeffers 47 46. Wakefield Marinesco 14 better than Lakeland and Hubble 55 41. Low scoring game out in Bessemer, Antonagin your winner, 40 to 29. Frankie Natson, 23 points, 16 rebounds. Mustangs, 52, Rapid River, 44. Carney Nato, a couple touchdowns better than the Peninsula, 49, 35. Win 40, Superior Central, 29. Taylor Bryant only had 22 points, 10 rebounds, nine assists and eight steals as Newberry wins again, 62-18 over Detour. And the Sioux traveled to Rudyard and went back home with a 49-30 win. And St. Ignace keeps its winning going, 75-53 over Sheboygan. To the boys, Great Northern Conference, Gladstone hosting Menominee, Adam Noldy. I'm sorry, that's a basket by Reese Caster, the old-fashioned three-point play. And here is Adam Noldy from the outside to get the Maroons going. Final minute of the first quarter, Tanner Brown, no. Caleb climbing the rebound. Nope, I'm one play ahead of myself. That is a basket by Hunter Hass. And Brad Spindler is going to score with some room service. <laughs> that happens every once in a while. Menominee, your winner, 53 to 40. Let's go to Alger County, Munising, and their rowdy fans taking on Manistique. And the Emeralds off to a good start. Darian Nichols, 4 0 Emeralds. Chiti Hoholik, 6 2, green and white. Al Graves, not pleased. Mustangs do get going. Cade Contreras drives, dishes to Corey Cody for the hoop. Mustangs within two. 
Jesse Matson the stop, the head fake, and turns back around and scores. Munising now within one. Contreras will stop and pop. He had 18. Tyler Tobin had 22 for Manistique, but Munising goes on to win this one, 57-52. Brett Johnson with that hoop. On the board, it is Hunter Radiola with 29 points. Chassel down, Stevenson 69-59. Nate Raisner had 20 for the Eagles. Colin Gannion, 24 points. Wakefield Marinisco back in the win column, 72-59 over Lance. You and Trout Creek, no problem with Republic Michigami. Ironwood, a long night at South Shore, losing 69-37. And the Sioux, three points better than Alpena, 62-59. College basketball, rough nights for Finlandia. The men lose 93-45 to Northwestern Minnesota. The women drop a 79-51 decision. Finlandia women only had eight points in the first half. Minnesota Duluth over Minot State, 71-55. Hotens Taylor, Taylor Dillinger, seven points and six rebounds for UMD. United States Premier Hockey League action. Let's go to Lakeview Arena in Marquette where the Royals were entertaining these guys, the Traverse City Hounds. Royals are gonna turn the puck over and this is not good news. Kyle Bowlers scores. Joseph Desenka, not much to do about that one. In fact, he was already having tr big troubles because he already had 20 shots on goal. Okay, some rough stuff. Got to have that in the league. And this Traverse City player, unfortunately, lost a chiclet in the process. To the second periods, Hounds pushing again. Cam Givens to Cam Fisher. Desenka stops this shot with his face. I guess he stopped that one on Tanaga. Just moments later, Ben Zion Jacoby takes a shot and it dribbles to Cam Fisher. He puts it in. Uh, ugly goal there. But the Royals scored three in the third. This one finishes in a tie at three. High school hockey. Wyatt Liston, a couple of goals for Houghton. 5-2 over De Pere. Hancock downs Bayport 8-4. Out in the Eastern UP, Marquette over Port here on Northern 6-3, and Sault Ste. Marie all over Canton 8-1. And Kyle Lake had two goals and a helper for Lance as the Purple Hornets beat Marinette Menominee 6-4. WCHA, NMU Idol, Michigan Tech Idol, Lake Superior State blasted by Minnesota State 8-0. Ferris State gets a goal 47 seconds into overtime to beat Bemidji 3-2, and it was Bowling Green 6 and Alaska Anchorage 2. Women's College Hockey, third ranked Adrian all over Finlandia, 11 to nothing. Some other news from hockey in the American Hockey League tonight. Iowa defeated Rockford 4-3 in a shootout. Hancock's Tanner Carroll had a goal and an assist for the Rockford Ice Hogs. And college hockey, Jerry York became the first college hockey coach with 1,000 victories tonight as Boston College blanked UMass 8-0. York has five national championships, one with Bowling Green and four at BC. And we will be right back. As we told you earlier, Bill Hill is no longer the assistant basketball coach at NNU. TV6 has learned an incident down at Grand Valley State last weekend precipitated the move. Thanks for joining us. Enjoy your weekend. Good luck wrestlers and skiers tomorrow.